PsycInfo is a large database for journal articles, summaries of dissertations, and other resources devoted to psychology. This database is intended to let you begin with a simple keyword search and then narrow down on the results page. Let's begin with a search on hyperactivity in children. Click on Search. You can see that this is a very large database. Initially there are 14,993 results. Let's begin narrowing our focus by choosing to see only scholarly results. Select the Peer Reviewed box. Then click on Update. This drops you to just under 12,000 results. Still too many to work with effectively. The genius of PsycInfo on the EBSCO platform is that it allows you to take a few stages to reduce the number of results by getting more specific about what you want. One good way to do this is to scroll down the left side and click on Subject, Major Heading. The terms within Subject Major Heading help identify what articles are actually about. Begin by checking off the subject heading Attention Deficit Disorder with Hyperactivity. Once you've made your selection, click on Update. You have cut the number of your results almost in half, but let's see if you can get numbers down to less than 100 while narrowing your topic. Go down the left column and decide what aspect of hyperactivity you are interested in pursuing. For this example, we are choosing Symptoms. Check off Symptoms and click Update. Having 359 results is better, but let's see if we could focus even more narrowly. The issue of symptoms of ADHD is especially important in Diagnosis, so let's select one more subject heading, Diagnosis. Click Update. With 32 results, you may have all you want. If you want more results to look at, you can remove any subject heading by clicking on the X next to it. This will raise the number of results by broadening the focus. You will see that some citations have full text linked to them, and some do not. For those that do not, look below the citations for links to other possible full text, perhaps in another database. For the citations themselves, you can save them to a temporary folder by clicking on Add to Folder. Your folder is in the top right area of your screen. Click on Folder View to access it. This folder is only a temporary holder for your citations. If you want to save citations for the long term, click on Save as File. You can set a citation format like APA before saving, then click on Save. Your references are now cited in APA format. Below you will see persistent links that will take you back to PsycInfo's entry for each article. You can also export your citations to a bibliographic manager.